Hi oh, guys, Luke Milgate here. Uh, we're uh, busy shearing today at, at uh, Ettrick Lodge uh, here at Servitine in Fur. I'll just take you for a quick little spin through the shed um, and, and show you what it's all about. Uh, this is the finished product. Obviously, this is our, uh, our fleece wool, which I'll show you shortly where it comes from. Um, we we packed that up, ran it up with our own name on it. Um, it's all sorted by a qualified professional classer, um, and that goes through the sale down in Melbourne. As we come through here, it gets pretty noisy. Uh, as you can see, I'll keep out of the way. We've got some uh, we've got some wool being skirted to take off all the, uh, the bad bits, for want of a better word. Um, and and uh, and then it's, it's rolled up, and they uh, they tell us what it is, whether it's it's good wool or bad wool, and we, we put it into each individual bale. So we've got a few bales running here now. Uh, if we duck down a bit further, as you can see, this is the, this is the business end of the deal. Um, these are these are all special shearers doing their thing, what they do best. Um, they can typically do 180 to 200 a day in a good day, a good day. Uh, that's what they come in like. 12 month wool. Um, so they've been running around in the paddock all year, growing the wool for us, eating eating grass and and hay that we've been feeding them, and we bring them in this time every year for shearing. Sneak out into the yards quickly. So the sheep come in this end of the shed, all nice and woolly and and uh, and fat, or well, looking fat, um, up into the sheep room, obviously, and then through through here after after the guys have been shearing them, um, they come come through out here. Each, each shear has been paid by how many sheep they shear every two hours. We call it a run. Um, and that's that's how it's done, pretty much. Um, pretty neat, clean job. They're very good at their job, these guys. Um, take pride in their work. And yeah, in a nutshell, that's how we shear here at uh, at Etrick Lodge on Etrick Farm. <laughs>